Hey, Crinto here with uh, another video and uh, and a box. See ya. Uh, see what it is. I've only cut the tape. I haven't actually opened it yet. Can you guess what it is? Oh. That's a hint. That's an even bigger hint. This is probably the cheapest acoustic bass that you will ever find. And as always, like I've been doing lately, It's off Amazon. Let's take a closer look at this. There's a, no banding on the top. And yes, it is also electric. So, uh, let me get this thing tuned up and see how it sounds. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't know if I ever uh, did a good review or not of something, but uh, and this uh, Timber Gear beast tuner I liked it so much I got two one's in turquoise for my uh, wife's ukulele because it matches the color and I got one in blue I like it a lot it's uh, incredibly accurate and I'll put a link for these as well As you see, it uh, just clips on and tunes right up. So I'll get this tuned and we'll see how it sounds. So, first things first, it is electrified, or it can be made electric as well as acoustic. Um, does not come with a 9 volt battery, so you're going to have one of those on hands. 
we uh, on hand. We just looked through everything we had, and we actually found a little stud finder that we won't need to be using for anytime soon. And we pulled the nine volt out of it, so I gotta go buy some nine volts. Anyway, um, it's real nice and shiny. It looks plastic, but it is not. Uh, it is a solid wood body. The face, uh, actually the whole uh, base seems to be a little thin, so don't expect it to survive a lot of, uh, so it might get dinged up, but uh, I, it feels good. It's full size, as you can tell. Uh, so this is a best choice products base. Um, it's a pretty no-name brand. It is acoustic electric, uh, cooked with a four-band EQ, reading off of the Amazon page. Uh, it's a guitar preamp. I will plug it in in a minute. Uh, it says for beginners and pros alike, which of course is going to say that. Uh, let's see. Right now, with Amazon Prime, it is $84.99. Yeah. It's an acoustic bass for less than $90. The cheapest bass that I've ever been able to find as an acoustic bass was a... Gosh, I don't remember the name of it. But it felt lower quality than this. And it was $200 or $175. So it... So, it sounds good. It, like I said, it's acoustic bass. It's not amplified at all. That is acoustic. The action is a little high. I haven't checked. Uh, I haven't checked anything yet because it is new. I haven't got to do things. There are little strings little threads <laughs> showing underneath these strings so these strings will need to be replaced very quickly um, just that little bit of playing and tuning is actually showing some thread on the strings so you're going to want to get new strings for sure that surprised me I just saw it because um, these are all going to be nylon core strings. Um, the nylon, eventually the metal wound will pull through. And you'll see little strings and threads. You won't be able to see it on camera. But trust me when I say right out of the box, you're going to want new strings. But anyway, solid wood. This is a rosewood fretboard. It looks very, very, very thick thin rosewood because rosewood's not cheap and this is a very very inexpensive base I'm not calling it a cheap base because a base that I had that was a lot more expensive than this wasn't this nice uh, it had a very similar 4 band EQ I think it might have even been the exact same one so for a base that I bought in a store I think it was Sam Ash it had almost the exact same electronics it's very well seated. I don't see anything in there. It's even got a gasket on it, so that's awesome. Um, I can tell that the body is a little thin. It doesn't seem super thin. That was one of the negative reviews that the base got. Out of 618 reviews on Amazon, it has four stars. So that's actually 
for a base that you'd expect to be super cheap, it's got no name brand on the neck even, or on the head. No name brand inside the body. And a uh, uh, wooden bridge. Doesn't look like it's... Yeah, so the, the bridge is going to be glued on here, but it's also tacked on with some dowels that you can see. It is threaded through the bridge and up, so you don't have to do any uh, fancy uh, threading when you go to restring it. It looks like this could be shaved down some. It, it's, uh, the, nut, the bridge nut is pretty pretty high. It also doesn't have notches. It looks like a solid solid bridge nut, which is cool because it means the strings can slide a little bit. I like that. This nut is also got some room to be shaved down if you wanted to take it to a luthier and do all that good stuff. As you can see, you can't tell anything with the fretboard. It is covered with this, uh, uh looks, looks plastic or laminate or whatever. The the frets, it looks like they've all been finished. That there's, there's no sharp spots that I'm telling, or uh, that I'm feeling rather. Uh, so, like I said, right out of the box, uh, you can play it right out of the box, tune it up, and use these strings a little bit until you need new ones. Uh, everything looks. Get on the back, you can tell it actually has a little label back here. What this label says is best choice products imported. Uh, date of manufacture is January 2019. Uh, it's got a PO number, it's got looks like a model number, and it says that it is a compliant product. I'm guessing it passed them some rules. This is uh, shipped by Best Choice. It got here in just a few days, so I don't think it's being shipped from China directly. I, I'm pretty sure it's a China product, but don't quote me on that. I don't know for sure. Uh, Best Choice Products. So, it is sold by Best Choice Products. Uh, let me read what they say about Best Choice on the uh, Amazon site. Best Choice Products, also known as Sky Billiards, was founded in October of 2002. Our company began its course selling pool tables, but in order for our business to expand, we needed to be more diverse with our products. That motivated us to expand by selling musical instruments and patio furniture. Yeah, that's a nice combo. Now Best Choice Products has a wide range of products that will fulfill all of your customers' needs, from children's items, pet products, to everyday household items, and much more. Best Choice Products ensures to have the best products at the lowest prices by dealing directly with manufacturers to sell products straight to you. We also pride ourselves on having fulfillment centers in both California and Indiana to help provide our customers with faster shipping. This came from Indiana, if I remember correctly. Best Choice Products appreciates the dedicated staff and hard work they put forth every day. Family-oriented company that places worth in every employee. Uh, guarantee satisfaction of the products through quality service. I did read on one of the reviews that the customer service was pretty good. They got a one that was dinged up, called customer service, got a brand new one in. So apparently the customer service is pretty good. And they've got like a 88% positive rating in the last year with 20, almost 27,000 ratings. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I am happy with it for now. Um, as you know, I'll probably do another video later after I've had it for a little while. I love how the pick card blends in with that because it's so shiny matte, uh, shiny gloss finish and it's a shiny gloss pick card. It's a little misplaced, but that's cool. I don't mind. Oh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I'll probably do another video in a few months uh, detailing how much I like it still. Um... Mm -hmm. So let's uh let's hear it plugged in. So uh, 
to find. Putting everything on mid. Everything is on mid. The amp itself, everything is in the middle. Shove the volume. It has a volume button right on the base, as most pickups do. So, Is I just noticed that it's really uh, a lot smaller than the rest, and uh, I just made, thought it was funny. I've played, so forgive me, it's not great, but I just want you to see how it is. You'll be a much better player than I am, I'm sure. held up on its tuning. How is it held up for tuning? So yeah, I like it. For 85 bucks, $85. This is an acoustic electric bass. I'm digging it. So I'll drop a link 
in the bottom for the Amazon. Uh, of course, nothing I ever do is sponsored because I've got like 12 of you guys that follow me. So subscribe if you want. I don't. I'm not going to lie. I'm turning it into a review channel. And it wasn't my intention, but it seems to be what I'm doing. So singing, reviewing, poetry, and RC stuff. Maybe a little bit of fish and stuff. Who knows? Um, I do a little bit of everything because it's in my channel and I can do what I want to with it. <laughs> but again, um, the action's high. The strings suck. But everything else, I'm digging. Um, I'm also going to put a link to the Beast. If you don't have one of these, I recommend getting one because they're really small. They're really easy to throw in a case or a bag. And, uh, accurate as hell um, again this is the timber gear uh, beast uh, chromatic tuner you just clip it on and go it's several keys you can do it in get one anyway I'm Crinto this has been the review of the best choice products acoustic electric bass check it in the link below and uh, I'll see y'all next time